क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोस फ्रॉम ईकीडा हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी प्रॉब्लम नंबर 10 बेस्ड ऑन वैल्यू ऑफ फंक्शन सो लेट अस स्टार्ट विद द प्रॉब्लम If f of x is equal to x square plus 2x plus 5, find x for which f of x is equal to f of 2x plus 1. Now this numerical is a little bit different. In last type we have covered the sums which are including LHS is equal to RHS. Now in this case it is already given that f of x is equal to f of 2x plus 1. So using this relation we have to find the value of x. So let us write the given equation. f of x is equal to x square plus 2x plus 5 also at the same time we'll find the value of f of 2x plus 1 so f of 2x plus 1 is equal to x will be replaced by 2x plus 1 so this becomes 2x plus 1 the whole square plus 2 into again 2x plus 1 plus 5 now to solve this bracket will expand this using the formula a plus b the whole square so a plus b the whole square will be equal to a square that is 2x square plus 2ab that is 2 into 2x into 1 plus b square that is 1 square plus 2 will be multiplied to both the terms so this becomes 2 into 2x that is 4x plus 2 ones are 2 and the remaining is plus 5 now the next step will will be 2x square will be 4x square plus here we have 2 into 2 into 1 that is 4 into x we have 4x plus 1 square becomes 1 plus 4x plus 2 plus 5 the next step will include simplification of similar terms that is 4x square 4x Plus 4x will give you 8x, and we have 1 plus 2 plus 5 that is equal to 8. Positive it. So 1 plus 2 will give you 3, and 3 plus 5 is 8. So we have f of x, and we have f of 2x plus 1. Now let us take this equation and equate both the parts. So we have f of x is equal to f of 2x plus 1. This part is already given. Now let us substitute the values. So f of x we have x square plus 2x plus 5, and f of 2x plus 1 is 4x square plus 8x plus 8. Now to further solve this equation, again we are going to say take the like terms on the same side. So here we have x square positive 4x square will become minus 4x square plus 2x. 8x will become minus 8x plus 5 and plus 8 will become minus 8. So we have taken all these terms to the left hand side. So here there is nothing except zero. So x square minus 4x square that is 1 minus 4 will give you minus 3x square. Again 2 minus 8 will give you minus 6x and 5 minus 8 will give you minus 3. That is equal to zero. So if you observe this we have a quadratic equation so by now you should know that we'll be getting two values of x since we have a quadratic equation now let us copy down this equation so we have minus 3x square minus 6x minus 3 is equal to 0 we can take minus sign common so all the terms will be positive that becomes 3x square plus 6x plus 3 is equal to Zero minus sign will be divided. That becomes zero only. And here we have three x square plus six x plus three is equal to zero. Further, this equation can be simplified by dividing each term by three. As you can observe, that each term is a multiple of three. So we will divide the equation by three. So if we divide three x square by three, we'll get x square plus 2x plus 1 that is equal to 0 so if you factorize further this equation if you know that this expansion is nothing but x plus 1 the whole square 
or simply you can say the product we are going to get is 1 and the two factors for 1 will be 1 and 1 itself. So 1 into 1 will be 1 and 1 plus 1 will give you 2. The middle sign goes to bigger number since both are same both here will be positive. So x square both will get, both will get x so this becomes 1x plus 1x plus 1 is equal to 0. If you take common terms in first two, you will get x as common. Here we will get 1x plus 1. Again both this term will have one common and the same part that is x plus 1 will be repeated. So x plus 1 into x plus 1 is equal to 0. It means we have x plus 1 the whole square that is equal to 0. That is we have x plus 1 is equal to 0. So x becomes minus 1. So this is a value of x is equal to minus 1. Hope you have understood this video. Thank you for watching this video. Stay tuned with Ikeda and subscribe Ikeda. Thank you.